this tiny device be the future of birth control? This is the Ballerine, a hormone-free platform that could revolutionize contraception. The Ballerine is known as an IUB or intrauterine ball and is basically the next generation of IUD. It's already being used by 100,000 women in 30 countries. Ocon Healthcare is the Israeli femtech company behind the groundbreaking invention. Unlike standard intrauterine devices or IUDs, which are T-shaped, the Ballerine is three-dimensional and much smaller. If you just look at the size, it just fits our anatomy much better. Finally, something that doesn't malposition or perforate. This is a ball, very flexible, very pliable. And because it's so small, it really caters to uh, an increased safety profile. It's 99% effective in preventing pregnancies for a period of five years and can easily be removed at any time. But the Ballerine also comes with fewer side effects than T-shaped IUDs and is reportedly much more comfortable. That's because it's made out of nitinol, a super elastic metal alloy that can be programmed to retain a certain shape. This compound is, has a memory shape that we uh, provide a spherical shape to the device, which open up in the uterus and on that frame, we are uh, placing the active uh, ingredients. In fact, even Ocon's CEO swears by it. I myself uh, started using it six months ago. For the past five years, the Ballerine has been sold in Europe, Israel and South Africa. Once Ocon receives FDA clearance, it'll be distributed in the United States as well. One Israeli doctor says that so far, his patients are very happy with the results. Actually, I have a very good experience because uh, first, it's very easy to insert. It's even easier than the other uh, IUDs. Last year, the global IUD market raked in $4 billion, according to the latest report by iMark Group. But for some reason, their basic shape hasn't evolved in decades. There hasn't been any innovation for forever. So, uh, you know, since the T-shape started uh, 40, 50 years ago, uh, they stay the same. Leshem hopes that the ballerine will change the way we look at birth control forever. This really demonstrates, um, you know, how we need to look at the female body specifically uh, and in more depth. Um, and I think we'll see a lot more technologies towards women in the next decade. From the central Israeli city of Modi'in, Maya Margit reporting for the Media Line.